Some people dream success while you're gonna wake up and work hard at it. So I got I went to the gym every day and I started pumping my arms, chest a little bit, you know, you're a kid. And it got good results. And I got fast results. Same with Missouri, I go to the joint turn this gym and uh, the first day he comes over and says, I'm gonna start training you and Man, the routine he put me on was insane. I put on about a good 30 pounds. Take that time. Really looks like your college halfback type. Now, standing there, of course, he's very muscular, but he doesn't, uh, he's not overly big like you'd anticipate. Now, as yeah. soon as he flexes, of course, <laughs> it, it comes alive. Now, what, he's just going through. Exactly. Various poses. The idea of posing is to show your, uh, show your muscles. That's the whole criteria of judging, to display your muscles that have taken thousands of hours to develop. Remember a big guy? Yeah. Only when he flex, the illusion comes. Oh, no, to get a, get a small shake shoulder. Yeah, that's good. Right. So what are the judges looking for? The, the symmetry of the muscles? Exactly. Is that the it? shape, the size, the lack of body fat, the whole bit. A lot of things change. They, they try to reinvent everything. Right. You can. It's this basic stuff. But the basics still work. It still works. Every show that I want, I go back to the gym the next day and I go, okay, back to basics. Right. How am I going to improve for the next show? Right. So it's nothing fancy, it's nothing new, it's nothing cosmetic. Barbell, squats, dads, and bench. Mm -hmm. You know your body. I know my body. You gotta listen to your body. Your body talks to you. Yes, it does. People don't listen. You know, it tells you when you're tired. It tell you when you're tired. It tell you when you're overtraining. It tell you you need to eat. Well, that comes from experience and time, of course. Pearson lights him up at the Taj Mahal. Definitely one of the best in the business.